I just got beat up in front of my kid, in front of my house. Doesn't seem fair. A homeless woman leaves a mother bloodied and bruised when she tells them to leave the North Park complex. Our attendance reporter Rial Creighton found out why police say they are powerless to force the attacker out. Rial. Steve and Itika, this was an all out brawl, mostly one sided. A woman claims that it was here in this apartment complex. She saw a homeless woman sleeping on the stairwell. She says she grabbed her, punched her, dragged her across this entire area. Let's take a look at how violent she says this was. That is her hair still hanging that was ripped from her scalp. Got that. Got that all from the ground and that hurts. Covered in bruises, Sherry Rodiger showing us the injuries she got after what she calls a beat down by a homeless woman right outside her door. This was from her and the eyes all red on the white. This the woman Rodiger says is usually sleeping on the lawn in front of her North Park apartment complex. She snapped pictures of her before to send to the landlord. Monday she says this woman was inside. She was right there on the stairs, laid out on the stairs like this, just like bam. She told her, you can't sleep here. Went like this to take a picture and she came up and just clocked me. Rodiger claiming she was trying not to fight back as she was attacked, dropped to the floor, punched and dragged. Trying to shoo her off of me, away from me. A giant clump of her hair still hanging on a plant near the ground. Her 14-year-old son, watching it all go down, called police. After all this injuries, I finally hit her to get her off of me. Rodiger says a neighbor had been helping the woman, occasionally allowing her to shower and to get mail at her address. So when the cops showed up, she says they told her they couldn't arrest the woman or even make her leave. Proof of address meant she'd established residency. Man, I just got beat up in front of my kid, in front of my house. Doesn't seem fair. And so police tell us they did take action here, but say there is a residency dispute involved, which they try not to get involved in. But coming up at 7 o'clock, why this woman isn't buying the police's reason for not arresting that woman on the spot. We're live in North Park tonight. Riel Creighton, 10 News.